everyone, this is Suzy Q of Suzy Q's Happy Little Haven, and welcome to my nursery room window. Hi everyone, so today Winnie is with me, and um, Winnie has a couple of her little bunny friends with her, and um, she wanted to come on and get changed into a cute little dress um, so that she could wish you all a happy Easter. And um, the dress was uh, gifted to our nursery um, by our dear friend, Shara of Reborn Living Dolls. And um, it's a darling dress and it was actually gifted for another baby, but um, I wanted to bring little Winnie on again. And so we're gonna get her changed into it. Um, so yeah, happy Easter, everyone. I hope that you're having a really good day today if you're uh, celebrating Easter um, with your family or friends or, you know, just with your spouse, maybe. I mean, it's just, for me, it's just my hubby and me. And uh, we're not doing anything special, but I am, uh, I do have a Sunday roast uh, in the oven right now, uh, roasting away. So um, it's going to be a really nice, easy dinner uh, for me to uh, prepare for tonight. But um, in the meantime, let me show you this outfit. Now, Shara, um, Shara had um, originally given, uh, the, uh, gifted this dress for my uh, darling little Annie which I'm going to be bringing back on very soon. Um, she is a very, she's a tiny little thing, uh, just like Winnie. And so um, I wanted to put Winnie in this dress um, to, sh to see what she would look like in it too. Um, this dress is just the most darling dress. Um, you can see that it has at the, uh, the bodice here, uh, these are embroidered, little tiny, let me see what you're seeing uh, little tiny embroidered flowers pink yellow blue blue yellow pink um yeah this these are hand embroidered i mean i can tell because i know how to embroider and these look ha handmade or hand done and then it's got this this darling little um little satin bow and then last but not least at all <laughs> it's got this um this lacy ruffle um around it looks like it's just around the front and then it's pleated um these pleats are just amazing um i'm not sure how they did this but you know the pleats are actually sewn in up here they're not just ironed in so it's a gorgeous gorgeous dress and well first of all i'll show you that it also came with these darling little bloomers and um, these look like that they were uh, hand embroidered along the edging too in a very, very light pink. And um, then the, uh, the, um, the bonnet, let me see what, um, I'm forgetting what, uh, this looks like, let's see if I can find a tag before I go, go any further um, to see. Let's see here. Oh, I'm looking for a tag and I'm not seeing a tag unless it's in here um no uh anyway i'm trying to think of the brand that i that normally does this type of a, of a dress and um, i can't think of it right now um Shara, if you could uh share that with me um if you're watching this video if you have time um you know let me know what this is because i do recognize this and it's just on the tip of my tongue uh, okay, so anyway, um, this is the little bonnet, and it has matching um, hand embroidered flowers on there, and then a matching little uh, pink edged uh, bonnet. Super, super cute. There's there's the back of the bonnet, and then it ties um, it ties off in um, this like a fabric bow. So uh, anyway, she I think she's going to fit into that and look really darling in it. And um, she's got a pair of shoes on that I'll give you a closer look at uh, that I changed her into uh, when I put um, this her um, this uh, gorgeous little dress back on her out of her box opening. So I will give you a better uh, a better look at those little shoes as I'm changing her. But um, anyway, this is the bunny that came with her in her box opening. I just did the box opening a couple of days ago. Um, she is a, she is the Coco Malou sculpt by Elisa Marks. And that sculpt was put out in um, 2014. And um, it is an open edition sculpt. So there isn't a, there is not a COA. However, 
Um, let me show you. This is a picture. I'll show you the picture that came with her that was um, taken by the artist. And this is her. This could be considered, you know, like a, a authenticity picture. And you can tell how old it is. It's on like paper, like a, I don't know, a parchment paper or something. But um, there's her original picture. And then um, her seller, for those of you who mix, missed the box opening, this is the uh, birth certificate that came with her as well. And so you can see all, all of her details on that. But um, I am just so excited and happy and thrilled to have her um, in my collection in my nursery. Um, she, she to me is just, um, she's, she's like a classic, you know, she's one of those classic sculpts. So, um, that I, I mean, that, that's my opinion. It's, and she's not an official classic, but it's just my opinion. And I'll show you some more details, um, as I get her dressed. So, um, right now, though, um, let's go ahead and, um, take the pillow away. Um, this is my Susie Q pillow that um, I always use, gifted to uh, my nursery by Auntie Claudia and her family. And uh, as you can see, Claudia, I use that pillow probably every time I do a video. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and move her little bunnies. And you can see in the background that um, I also have some bunnies set up. And whoops, that little bunny. That little bunny keeps wanting to fall over. Yeah, I'm going to get her. An, um, another pillow to lay down on and I think I will choose I'm going to choose this pillow I think it's very special yes yeah put her on a very special pillow so yeah this um this sculpt I'll tell you the dimples the, the dimples in her chin I mean she's got like little dimples in her chin she's got dimples in her cheeks um She's just, she's just a uh, darling. I, I just can't get enough of this little one. Um, now, before I get started on getting her dress, though, um, I wanted to show you um, a couple of cards that I received for Easter. Um, this one came in the mail yesterday. Uh, oh, today's Sunday. I don't know if I mentioned that. It, it is Easter Sunday. And uh, so this came in the mail yesterday. And this came from my dear friend, Edith and um who lives all the way in the uk and so thank you edith um for that i was it was a surprise you know i wasn't expecting that but let me show you what it is um it opens up into a like a laser cut little easter tree and the easter tree has all of these little dangly um little easter eggs can you see those I mean, isn't that the cutest card? You know, I love, you know, these laser cut cards amaze me. And then he, you've got this little, uh, this little Peter Rabbit, this little Easter bunny uh, riding his bike. He's got a, a little basket full of, looks like little Easter gifts that he's delivering to all the children. Um, so yeah, um, Edith, I just, I just love this card. So um, thank you. Thanks again for, uh, for sending it. And it even has like decorative uh, border along the, whoops, along the edging right there, all four edges. So thank you so, so much. And I'm going to put this card. Let's see, where can I, well, I'm not going to be able to display it right now. And then um, another card that I received, um, some of you have seen this card before. This is from... Um, our Auntie Claudia, and um, Auntie Claudia um, has a channel. Well, she she's not active on the channel, but she her channel name is Auntie uh, Auntie Dot Claudia, and so we all call her Auntie Claudia. But this is an Easter card from her and her family, and so I wanted to show that again. And um, I wanted to thank everyone um, also that sent me. Um, um, happy Easter e-cards. Um, I appreciated them so much. It was really, really a very nice touch. And then um, Sanja, um, I haven't had a chance to, uh, I've been really super busy this morning, but um, I will, um, not Sanja, I think Sonja, S-O-N-J-A. Um, she, she actually does a lot of her, uh, displays her babies on Instagram. 
And so she, um, it looks like that she sent me a note on Instagram. And so I thank you for that, Sonia. And um, I will, uh, you know, I will um, open it and reply to you just as soon as I can. But I appreciate uh, you sending. Um, she, always, she always sends me beautiful pictures and um you know like if it's a holiday or something it'll be holiday pictures and uh, sometimes she'll just send me pictures of her baby so um yeah she's really sweet okay everyone let's go ahead and get started before i get uh too wound up in in this conversation i know that you're getting excited to see little winnie right here so uh, i'm gonna take her shoes off first and I'll show you why I'm going to, I'm going to keep, uh, I'm going to put these same shoes back on her because look at that. She has shoes. These shoes that I found for her the other day actually have little um, embroidered roses on them. And there's like a pearl on each side. So, um, uh, and then it's got little uh, lace, lacy, uh, curled little straps. So um, these are just perfect for her for this outfit. Um, these are from Will Beth, uh, made in Columbia, and they are size zero, zero month. And uh, she does have tiny little feet. Uh, the other day, uh, I was talking about her and I said, yeah, she's, she's another one of my babies, um, uh, much like my little Annie, that is sort of in between a preemie and a newborn. And so um, her little, she has little tiny hands and t little tiny feet, and she's just precious. She is just precious. So um, these are the little preemie socks that I'm going to be putting back on her too, because I just think they're perfect. I just really do. I think this is just really exciting. Now, um, I love this bib. This bib actually came with her in her box opening and it came with another outfit in her box opening but and I would love to put this back on her today however the dress that Shara gifted us um, is so cute it's got the bodice that has the embroidery and I and I just don't want to cover that up I just don't and so the little Easter this little Easter um little Easter bib is, um, she's, she's just going to have to, you know, wear it some other time, <laughs> I guess is what I'm trying to stumble around and say. But um, let's go ahead and take her little dress off. And this one's really, um, really an easy one. It looks like there's just like two buttons. And this dress, um, the seller later contacted me. Um, she watched a bit, her box opening video and um, she was from reborns.com. Um, she watched the box opening video and uh, she she told me that this dress right here was actually um, is actually a handmade dress from Spain. And I thought that was really, really neat, too. You know, uh, it's just gorgeous. And yeah, I can see that it is. Um, so uh, anyways, I love this dress on her and this this dress would also um, look really cute on Annie. So it looks like these two little ones um, are going to be sharing um, outfits um, back and forth between each other. So yeah. Now, um, I haven't had a chance to um, to fix her. Um, sh she has a, a body that's too puffy right here. You can see that it's just kind of really puffy. It looks, the, the way that it, she's done is, I, it looks like she's, um, well, she's got a, a very nice um, suede uh, body. But what happened is this, um, the, the person that made this um, uh, baby doll um, put all the, um, they put all the weight in the, down here and then just all the puffiness up here. And so it's not evenly distributed. So she looks very, very, chesty <laughs> and so i really want to get a i, I really want to fix that and i'm going to but um i just i've been really super busy and i haven't had a chance to um come back in the nursery and take care of that so but uh but i will maybe hopefully the next time you see her she's not going to be so puffy up here yeah yeah we'll just blame it on too much milk got stuck in there how about that <laughs> so yeah um, I'm going to go ahead and leave these little, this little onesie on because I think it's going to work out okay um, underneath these, uh, this, these sleeves. But um, did I show you the back? It's got cute little buttons. Gosh, I'm trying to think of the name of this brand. I, I, know, it's on, I know what it is. Um, 
my friend, uh, my friend Holly had gifted me a dress, a larger dress that um, has the same type of uh, detail. And um, I just cannot think of it. Um, but Shara, I know that you know, Shara is, um, she, uh, she, she buys a lot of um, uh, outfits from different places. And uh, I would consider her an expert, a clothing expert. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, a clothing brand expert. I'm I'm not so much. Um, not at all, actually. I don't. Not even much. But um, uh, yeah. But I do enjoy, um, and, you know, knowing about the different brands and things of clothes. But yeah, this these um, these are size zero zero. The, these little uh, bloomers and the dresses too. So she's a she's a size zero zero. So there she is. As she is, and here are, are her little feet, tiny little feet. Now I have small hands, and um, her feet are even smaller than my pointy finger. Yeah, they're darling. She's just a darling little girl, a little, little baby girl. Um, I'm also going to leave this rose um, headband on her because I think it goes perfectly with all the roses. So, yeah. Let's see. Okay, so I'm going to put this over her head. I was thinking it buttoned all the way down, but it's a nice big opening, so it'll work perfectly. So um, anyway, yeah, I hope you all are having a great day today. Um, Easter uh, for for me has, has really good uh, fun mem memories um, for when I raised my two kids. Um, I, last night I was thinking about this. Uh, last night was Saturday night, and um um we ha we lived in the last the last house that we lived in um when the kids were older um w had in the master bedroom and had a walk-in closet okay and so um every saturday night the saturday night before easter i would spend a couple of hours up in that closet with the door shut uh, it was a big closet so no you know no problem there but um, I would take all of my Easter goodies that I had had uh, bought, um, you know, the past few weeks, and I take all of the Easter goodies and and shut myself up in that closet, and um, I would, uh, you know, fill everybody's Easter baskets up and um, just have a great time and uh, doing that. So yeah, last night was, you know, Saturday, like I said, and it was the night that I always did that, and it just kind of, I always remember that. Um, so the Saturday night before Easter. So, yeah. Um, let me put this little bonnet on her. Let me just put this little bonnet on her. It's okay if it goes over the headband. Isn't that darling? Oh, it fits her perfectly. She and Annie are the same size, Shara. So they are going to be able to share this little dress. Little dress and bonnet. Doesn't that look darling? <laughs> come on you guys come on you guys you know it does you know it does all right let's put her um her little socks back on and oh and getting back to the um the easter basket so one 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 easter i told my hubby you know i said you know what um this this was i think it was before might, might have been before an, an easter i said you know what everybody gets an easter basket but me i i never get an easter basket you know because i wanted to, i wanted all the goodies too and um so anyway, one Easter, my hubby surprised me um, with an Easter basket. And this bunny, this is, I mean, this was many, many years ago. And let me show you this bunny that you've seen a couple of times um, from years and years ago. I wonder if there's a date on it. Um, yeah, 1989. <laughs> 1989. Um that was when he gave me an Easter basket and he found this tiny, this is a tiny little bunny. Look at, see how, you know, how, how big it is. Um, he found this tiny little bunny and he put this little bunny in the Easter basket and I was blown away. And I have, um, and I sit, I have saved this little bunny. Of course I ate all the goodies. Um, but I saved this little bunny to, um, always have in my nursery because it reminds me of it. the very the very one time that he um that that he gave me an easter basket all on his own picked out all the candies did everything you know and uh, i'm always thrilled when hubby does stuff all on his own i mean isn't that a good feeling ladies that 
you know, have spouses or boyfriends or partners that will um, just kind of on, on their own go do special stuff like that. I, I think it's really, really neat. You know, it, it's what it is for me. It's really neat, I guess, because he doesn't do it all the time. I suppose if he did it all the time, then it wouldn't be, it'd be like, oh, another Easter basket. But, you know, it, that was the one and only Easter basket. So I treasure that bunny. <laughs> I treasure that bunny. Yes, I do. Yeah, these shoes fit her perfectly, too. And they also fit little tiny Annie. I'll show you the Annie that I'm talking about, you guys. Um, I'm sure you're curious by now. This is Annie. She's a tiny little thing too, and um, she whenever uh, whenever Shara gifted this dress that um, I just put on little Winnie, um, she also sent this gorgeous. Um, this is a gorgeous, uh, like, pacifier clip, a handmade. Look at all the pearls and you know, whoever, whoever made this is just wow, 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 and it's got all this these uh, little jewels on it and see it even has um, Annie's name on it and um, what happened was what Shara told me oh and look at this porcelain this little porcelain rose but what happened was um, so Shara uh, oh and this gift this was a this is her little special little lovey that she's always going to have with her it's from her her very special um, auntie Shara so, um, but anyway, Shara said that she has, she already had this uh, dress and bonnet and this clippy that she had for another one of her babies, but she didn't have that baby anymore. And uh, I hope I'm getting the story right, Shara. Um, and so when she saw me um, opening up little Annie, you know, the box opening, she, she thought, oh, you know, the dress and, and the, um, and the, the pacifier clip and everything would just be perfect <laughs> and uh, and I agree so thanks again Shara and I will be bringing this little one on um, um, I think I'll bring her on in one of my next videos and um, I'll get her all changed up into a, a cute little um, little spring summer dress so um, so yeah but look at how um, darling she looks oh I want to show you this she, she this one also came with a pacifier you know, with a little bow like that. And I'll show you what she looks like with a pacifier, but um, I don't, I don't put, let me see, does it, does it even work? Uh, no, it doesn't, it doesn't even work. It must have just been for show, but um, anyway, it's got a, it's got a magnet, but the magnets aren't matching. Didn't match, so she must have. The seller must have found a pacifier, but didn't check it first, and that's okay. Because, you know, what I was about to say is, um, I don't use pacifiers on my babies, and I and I never have because I think they look. I think a pacifier um, will cover up their expression of the baby. You know, it just covers up their whole face. Just my opinion, just for me, you guys. And um, I really like to see their face because a lot of times the, um, the reborn has a lot of expression and char characteristics in their face. And so that's why I don't use a pacifier. So, so yeah, but, um, the, the, um, but I do use them. Um, I will some, sometimes stage with them um, like I do uh, with little Annie. I you know, always bring her pacifier on with her um, whenever I go to change her. So, yeah. That's just how I, that's just how I roll, you guys. But um, anyway, what do you think of this little darling? Oh, my goodness. She is so cute in this dress. I mean, she really is. This dress fits her so well. There she is. Hi, everybody. And there's her little shoes and socks. And she's got her little, she's got her little bloomers on underneath. So, yeah. Oh, wow. I love this dress on her, Shara. I really, really do. I think both both of my little babies look cute in this dress. Um, this dress and this bonnet um, is just really, really a winner. So thanks again for sending. But um, anyway, everyone, um, happy Easter to you all. Um, just wanted to pop on and uh, change little Winnie for you and put her into another little Easter dress. Um, 
I hope you all are having a really nice day today, uh, whatever you're doing with either friends, family, or just, or just uh, taking little walks or just on your own today, you know? Uh, let me see. Let me get them situated. Are we okay in the camera? So um, thanks a lot for joining me today, you guys. Um, it's been really fun visiting. Um, yeah, I really appreciate your company. So have a wonderful rest of your day. And um, goodbye for now from me, little Winnie, and both of her little bunny friends. Bye-bye.